I flew Thai smooth as silk from Bangkok to Manila. I chose preferred seat as it is more comfortable. I enjoyed my time throughout the flight. If you ask me, what from the Philippines can be one of the world's most famous brands? I'll say Jollibee. My friends Choi and Roy took me to the branch in Intramuros to try their fried chicken and spaghetti today. I've seen Jollibee everywhere in Manila. Um, as of 2018 of April, huh. there are more or less 1,200 locations for right. branches nationwide. Okay. What's so special about the chicken or the food? It's very special because it's tender and juicy at the same time. And of course, <laughs> it's perfectly paired as well with the sweet jolly spaghetti. Okay. It's a must try. And chicken is like the special and favorite kind One of meat. Of their kind of meat. But basically, they started with sandwiches, burgers, and everything. Then they added the chicken oh. and the spaghetti. Next, Aaron, another local friend of mine who works in education field, took me to a popular local restaurant in Manila. Gary, Gary, I've heard of the name before. Yes. It's quite a famous dish here. Yes, it is. So is, is it made of chicken? The what are the ingredients? Curry curry is a dish that you have a peanut sauce. Peanut sauce. What's inside is uh, oxtail oh. and some ox stripes. Yes. So something uh, internal organ. Wow. Okay. So, so and also beef chunks okay. and vegetables. All right. I'll, quite creamy. Yes. Okay. This one, Sinigang. This one is the the sauce. It's made from tamarind. Yes. And oh, so, so that's why some people call it tamarind broth. Yes. National fish. It's okay. called the milk fish. Milk fish. Or in Filipino, it's bangus. Bangus. Wow. So that part is the favorite part of many. Yes, the so belly. Okay. Belly part. And some long beans. Yes. And. and Chili? Chili. Big chili. Okay. And eggplant. Okay. And some kangkong. Wow. And, uh, Look like a uh, healthy. This one also sisig. Sisig. Sizzling pork. Okay. So it has a, uh, how do you call that? Uh, crispy chicharron uh -huh. and uh, ox brain. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Everything together. <laughs> that makes it creamy. Okay. And it's a little spicy. Okay. So it's best for, you know, drinking wine or okay. beer. All right, all right. So that's it. I'm here at Barbara's Heritage Restaurant after spending the whole afternoon in Intramuros. In a slide. It looks so good. Everything. Wow. Everything. And, yeah. And after I'm, I'm dining so all hungry. afternoon, yeah. I'm yes, so yes. starving, and then I can't wait to taste it. Yeah. Filipino food tonight. Is this your first time to taste it? This one, I think I'm family with this one. I used it out before. I love it. Kampong, right? Yeah. Kampong. Water, Water spinach. Spinach. Water. Water spinach. spinach. Yes. Fried yes. with garlic. Yes. yes. And this one is similar to Thai shrimp paste, but it's not. Yes. But what? But what? But what? This one is one of my favorite ones. I love this one as well. And the special thing is you eat with mango. Mango. Yes. Anything that you can put. Sometimes I use sometimes I use bagong, like bananas, or okra, or anything green. Okay. And don't forget the lato, which is the seaweed. Seaweed. Okay. This one. Right. What are you having instead of this? Um, aside from what you got, I got um, beef calderet. 
which we got from the Spaniards. So it's beef stew, but we put bell pepper and, and potatoes okay. and some tomato sauce. We've come to a local market called Mercato Central in BGC, a new hip area in Manila. Right, so we have... So adobo is actually a... It's, it can either be chicken or pork. Okay. That's actually slowly cooked in vinegar. In vinegar? And soy sauce. Okay, yes. Here, they put that, uh, that dish inside the burrito. Say it's tender, not too, not too tough. Yeah, because again, it's a uh, adobo is slowly cooked in vinegar and soy yeah. sauce. Yeah, I feel the vinegar flavor, and I love egg, tes, and this is rice. Yes, and rice. Good, good. Is the popular lechon. Exactly. Lechon is uh, lechon Tagalog. Is my belly right now. <laughs> belly. So lechon is, means pork uh, belly. How it actually uh, how it's actually cooked. So, yes. so we can explain better. It's more of there's a there's a bed of charcoal that's actually lighted up. Oh yes. And then that whole roasted uh, pig. Yeah. Is actually stick in a in a long uh, barrel of stick. Uh -huh, and uh -huh. it actually rolls. Roll, roll for hours. For, it's actually eight hours and more. Wow. Okay. So it actually achieves that. Uh, if you see here, yes. it actually achieves that crispy skin. Yeah. You'll never get that in the oven. I think this, is, this is considered as the national food. No part is it complete without that as well. Yeah. For this. We have to eat with sauce? Not entirely, because entire. uh, it's actually good on its own. Okay. Yeah, you can also prefer to have it with sauces. Well. Okay. Or not. Okay, let me try. Mm. Personally, for me, it's best with vinegar. Okay, let's try a little. Yeah, it goes a long way with vinegar. Because it's actually a good blend of the salty and then the tangy. And you said it can be like a snack with beer or snack it can be beer, like main rice, dish. It can be a main dish. Mm. It can be after you're burned out or oh. something. Yeah. <laughs> so it's, it's like an, everyday dish. It's an everyday dish. Also, it, uh, it's close to your heart. It's close to your heart because it makes you, makes you love God. Oh, <laughs> okay. The accommodation always plays an important role in my trip. I love Magati area as it is convenient to go anywhere, so I stayed at Fermont Magati this time. I'm a Fermont Gold member, so I stayed in a separated floor with its own check-in and service counter. I love the spacious and nicely decorated room. But the most important thing for me is to stay connected and have a great large desk to work in my bedroom. On this floor, there's an executive lounge where you can have breakfast or evening canapes and cocktails. There are meeting rooms too, so I think it's really convenient for both business and leisure. I always work out, and the gym facilities here are great. They even have a large swimming pool to enjoy. Hope you enjoy the trip. Stay tuned for the next episode. Please subscribe.